tonight's Hoops 8. Hi, Travis. Hey, guys. Uh, an interesting cross-class clash in Falmouth tonight. Falmouth taking on Portland. Falmouth number one in the heel points, looking to avoid a second loss in a row. Great game. Tied in the fourth. Remy Jawani inside, working, muscling. Portland takes the lead, but here comes Falmouth. Chris Simons working the glass for two. Then Lucas Dilworth finds Billy Burks back cutting. Falmouth's lead goes up to four. Portland responds. The kick out to Kevin Rugabira from three. And they're down one, 39-38 with three and a half to go. Under a minute to play. Wani wants it inside. The basket and one. Portland goes up one with 45 seconds left. They get the offensive rebound. Kennedy Charles hits two free throws to go up three, and then Charles seals it with the steal, and Portland rallies for a fourth quarter win, 44-41. They walk out of Falmouth with the victory. Edward Little and Wyndham in a matchup of three and eight teams that really could win any night in their league. Eddie skipping it over the zone. Muhammad Adao for three, and then Adao returns the favor. The skip to Marshall Adams, who buries the three. Wyndham responds from downtown. A.J. Moody knocks it down. He had 12. Then Owen Coombs inside. Pivots his way into a layup. And Wyndham with the 53-50 win. Pick up win number four. Greeley at Lake Region. What a finish. Greeley trailed by seven with 91 seconds left. Here comes the comeback. Seamus Raft is the three. They're down one with 20 seconds to play. Evan Dupre at the line hits one of two. 60-58 Lake Region. 6.7 seconds left. Hayden MacArthur driving, ties it up for Greeley. Lake Region, though, plenty of time. Dupre gets it at half court, and he coasts in for the sweet lefty layup to go up with 1.2 seconds left. Greeley, a chance, though, but they're inbounds. They can't get it in and get a shot off, and Lake Region rallies for the 62-60 win. Big win over Greeley. All right, Marshwood. Just beat Falmouth, had its hands full at one win Morris tonight. The shipbuilders, who haven't had their starting five together all year, take the lead. Gabe Morris in the lay-in. For Marshwood, Andrew Perry, catch and release. Other way, same thing. Gavin Belair's on an early five-point lead for the shipbuilders, but Marshwood will rally. Jason Singer to Cooper Egier, 46-34. Marshwood rallies for the win tonight. Cape Elizabeth boys hosting Trape Academy. Andrew Trakamilwitz with the corner three to give Cape a first quarter lead. But the other way, David Durling picks up the easy points in transition for the Rangers. Capers go on a run. Alex Van Husty, the nice move in the lane. Then Eddie Caldera, the pass ahead to Owen Ty for the layup. He had 14, 44-38, Cape the victory. Class C South Boys, Old Orchard at NYA. Nate Oney from downtown. NYA smelling the upset, they're up 10. They had a big third. Cal Nice, the turnaround from the foul line. He led the way with 17 for the Panthers. But Landon Johnson goes to work. The spin and circus finish that ignites a comeback. 52-46 Old Orchard wins that he had 23 for the Gulls. A big C showdown in Old Orchard tonight on the girls' side as two big-time stars in that conference meeting up as unbeaten NYA and Angel Huntsman visiting Elise McNair and Old Orchard. NYA led at the half, but Huntsman sat the entire third with four fouls. But the other Panthers stepping up. Gracia Bila, the tough shot in traffic. Then Sarah English picks up the loose ball and lays it in. A little later, Bila on the glass. She had 17 points, five boards. They actually built the lead with Huntsman on the bench. McNair tried to keep the goals close. She had 22 points. But then English puts it away. She had 16, 55, 37. The Panthers are unbeaten. Thornton Academy and Gorham in the Trojans annual Hoops for Hope game. The girls basketball team raising $15,000 for people dealing with cancer. Congratulations to them. Trojans, when they got on the floor, were feeling it. Hannah Cook hits the three. Then, off the inbounds play, Addison Sulikowski, she had 21. Kylie Lamson doing it as well, knocks down the three. She had 18. A little later, Lamson finds Emily Coleman for the lay-in, 64-30. Thornton Academy now 13-0. All right, the Portland girls hosting Falmouth at the Expo. This is a good one. Anna Turgeon taking it to the hoop for the Navigators. They're up five in the third quarter. Bulldogs respond. Annie Posey gets inside for the basket. Then Emma Shaw hits the baseline jumper. Bulldogs take the lead. But Turgeon with the three, 54-50. Falmouth the win. All right, Greeley hosting Lake Region. The Lakers, a dangerous team on the perimeter. Melissa Mayo from NBA range knocks it down. She had 19. For Greeley, Cassidy Dean inside. The nice cut, Rangers by six. But here comes Lake, Olivia England, what else? Another deep three, and they're back in it. Greeley on the back door, Sophia Ippolito to Greer right for the hoop. 
Middle of the fourth, Margot Tremblay, another three, and Lake Region would come back to tie it at 46 with three minutes to play. But Greeley ends the game on a run. CeCe Berthium, the clutch three, Greeley takes it 62-53 over Lake Region. All right, Trape Academy hosting Cape Elizabeth. Rangers working inside. Hannah Thorson asks for it. She gets it, and the lay in for two. Capers score on the inbounds play. Megan Conley with the short J inside. But Trape goes on a run. Emmy Hale buries the three from the corner. She had 15. Thorson would get 26 points on this night. And Trape with the home win, 55-29 over Cape Elizabeth. Waynefleet hosting defending state champ Haldale. Bulldogs out and running. Amanda Trepanier ahead to Hayden Medore for the layup. This is what they do. And then a little later, KJ Greenhall ahead to Medore, who had 22. Haldale pulling ahead early on. Then Tori Tibbetts gets free inside for the basket. Haldale with the impressive win, 58-24. All right, Northern B, Herman at Ellsworth. Ellsworth coming in 9-2 on the year. Abby Riddell driving in the paint for the basket. And Ellsworth rolling tonight, 77-45. This team a threat up in the north. That is Hoop Safe for tonight.